Hi everybody, this is Axe Reacts, and welcome back to another episode reaction of Fairy Tale. Today we're moving on with episode 248, and uh, going to see what happens in this one. We left off last video, guys, with uh, this big, crazy moment. I'm still trying to make some sense of it, uh, what exactly happened. Uh, Tartarus kind of had a little trick up their sleeve, it seemed, and they basically like the whole cube itself that they were all fighting on basically transformed in, I don't know if it's like a demon itself or, or something else is happening with it or some, it's some curse. Uh, I, I'm still gonna, hopefully they'll get explained more in this episode guys. And we'll learn more about it, but yeah, basically the whole cube itself started to transform. It almost looked like a mouth, like some kind of creature, uh, inside of it. And it all turned to where this like inside, like, weird area. I don't even know how to describe it yet. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Uh, but yeah, it started to basically just absorb everybody, villains and heroes alike. So uh, pretty much, guys, the entire fairy tale team got wiped out uh, and is now trapped inside th this thing, whatever it is. And even, you know, the random enemies that they were facing got trapped inside. It did not look like Minerva or any of the nine demon gates were stuck inside. Um, they're they're you know excluded from that, but everybody else it seems to kind of get stuck, and now they're just like, you know, in stasis, stuck in this thing, and we're not we're not sure what's going to happen next. There was one uh, survivor from this attack, and it's Lucy, who, uh, you know, just they basically just said luck of the draw, you know, just kind of you know one in a million chance that you would survive this attack. So she survived it, and we left off the last time, guys, with her n having no clue what happened or what to do next. So uh, hopefully, guys, we're going to find out what happens next uh, with her, and hopefully she can rescue everybody, I'm assuming. She looks like, the, from the preview last time, guys, that she's going to call on some spirits to help her out, so we're going to hopefully uh, learn more about that as we go. We also, guys, last time got to learn a little bit more about Mira Jane and her siblings and how they joined Fairy Tale. I thought that was really cool. And we got some big reveals with the uh, Crime Sorcier and, you know, their whole, you know, Try, recruitment basically with the Sace. Uh It looks like Sace is now going to stick with them officially and kind of join in with them. Uh, we also kind of got to meet some of the survivors um, from Grimoire Heart and they kind of clashed a little bit. We got to learn a little bit more history with them, uh, which I thought was awesome. I love how they brought them back too. So we're going to see what happens with all that uh, as we move forward today with Fairy Tale. So thank you guys so much for tuning in and hanging out with me today. As always, I do appreciate it. Please like the video, guys, if you haven't yet, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet for more reactions coming soon. Uh, I also have a Patreon if you are interested in helping to support this channel. Well, you're welcome to do that. I have the uh, link in the description below, so feel free to check it out. All right, guys, we're going to move on with episode 248. Here we go. Yeah, not good. And we met this guy too, I, I, Greer, I, Gear, I think. He's like the underworld king, and he's holding the END book. The so I'm not sure what all that means yet. Many lives just now, but one seems to have avoided its grasp. What is all this? It looks like some kind of tissue. The chance of surviving that curse is less than one in a. All right, so it was a curse. So we know that much at least. But yeah, it's like tissue, like the insides of like some demon or creature, it looks like to me. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so I don't know what to make of all that yet, guys. We're going to hopefully find out more about what's going to be happening. Oh, right here in the credits, we saw that Fairy Tale was destroyed. So that would have been a little spoiler uh, if I kind of watched these before it happened. Um, so I'm, I'm glad I avoided that at the very least. But yeah, this is a. Uh, I'm enjoying the song, enjoying the credits. I, I did want to comment because I noticed last time that this song is, I think, the only fairy tale song so far that has like a duet going on. Usually it's only like a female singer or a male singer, and this one kind of has both kind of playing off each other. So I thought that was really cool, especially now with like kind of showing Lucy and Natsu together. It kind of like plays off each other a little bit with the song. So I thought that was a really cool, cool moment there. We don't know who they're going to face yet. Some kind of flowing cape. I'm assuming it's Greer. And this fight's upcoming still. We have, uh, I know, Juvia and this uh, Kia's guy. That's going to be upcoming too. Oh, okay, so it looks like Jackal and Tempest are going to be in this thing. Coming face-to-face -face with Lucy. 
Excited to see Sting and Rogue. Yeah, and Sheila. She Sheila was a, a big demon villain that I, like, sh she scared me a little bit. <laughs> she was creepy looking. Um, but, yeah, I think she was defeated. I don't know if she'll be back or not. It looked like they, they, Mira Jane was able to defeat her for good. Everything's different. Not so? Where are you? Uh, so she, okay, yeah, so everybody's trapped in this thing now. You can't, I'm assuming you can't just cut them out. Like, that's not going to work. Jeez. Now it's up to Lucy, or Lucy, yeah. No help. She has no idea what to do. It's like Monstro, the, the whale from Pinocchio. <laughs> That's what it reminds me of. Strike from the stars. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I'd, I'd be getting out of the street. <laughs> I'd be running and hiding him out. Seeing this thing fly above you. Is that what destroyed the guild hall? Oh my god, is it just... Wave of destruction as it goes. Oh my god. So thousands are probably just being killed right now. You can't escape this. Demons of Tartarus. I've used the Allegria. The intruders' lives have been snuffed out. Our plans remain unchanged. The face's activation is imminent. He can't have really wiped out everyone else. And I thought Wendy had already stopped face. Maybe he's lying. Yeah. <laughs> I sense that one unfortunate human soul has managed to avoid the Allegria's reach. So the Alleg Allegria is the this whatever this thing is now the cube. I'm assuming the cube is Allegria, or a demon inside of it, or some curse. Still making sense of all this. I'm sorry, guys. Could it be true? Am I the only one left? I see her. This one is mine. Sorry, boys, but I've got other plans. Lucy can surf, all right. And the villains can surf. <laughs> well, she's good at it. Dude. Wow. I'd be falling myself. I would have fallen already. Lucy kicks. Good job. Job, Leo. Impressive. Not even Regulus's power could block it all. Thanks, Loki. You okay? I'll be fine. <laughs> Keeping two gates open at once, it looks painful. Virgo and I use more magic power than most. For Lucy's sake. For the sake of my princess. I'll fight back. I'll end it. <laughs> oh, man. More eye candy. A third demon? This is bad. Strange. I thought there was only one of them. 
of you left. You already beat him. He's self-destructive. He possess the power of immortality. Our lab is the most valuable tool in the world, and as long as we have that, we can keep coming back. This guy gave Natsu a hard time. It's not like he can summon another celestial spirit. It's up to me. <laughs> you haven't forgotten how my curse works, have ya? Oh, man. Lucy! Princess! Where are my friends? And what's that red stuff all over the wall? <laughs> the blue cat and the fireball are dead. Which means torturing their little friend here is the only kind of revenge I'm probably gonna get. So I gotta save her the moment! Oh, no! Between keeping our gates open and taking those attacks, she's got to be close to her limit. Every time I've needed saving, one of them has been there. Now it's my turn. I can't let them down! Lucy! I don't care how strong you are! I'm still hoping that, like, Wendy comes in and helps, helps out. Cause she's somewhere out there still with Thornbolt. Damn idiot. <laughs> Who the hell is that? She's my friend. Just stay out of my way. Oh. That thing. It's swimming against my current. What is the specialty of mine? Ah! Leave the Aquarius alone! Damn it! blood. I didn't know spirits could breathe. So what? Bringing out three chumps at once was your big play? Looks like Fairy Tales Last Wizard Standing is all tuckered out. <laughs> if we play our cards right, we can torture her for hours. But remember, we're gonna give me all the credit. <laughs> I can't let it end like this. Everyone's counting on me. There has Get to vibes be of like the naval battle. <laughs> Again, like she tries so hard, she doesn't give up, but like it's still not enough. <laughs> I've had enough of your games. If you won't finish her, I will. Huh? Tell me, whose side are you on here? If it's death you're after, I'd be happy to give you one. I'm through with this. Suit yourself. <laughs> well, now that I have permission. So, what's next? Like to direct your attention to our boots. They're way too big. Let's blow them up. <laughs> Kaboom! Kaboom! Oh my god. Noisy twerp. <laughs> Jeez. 
Why, yes, I did. And if that's how I treat my friends, then think of what's in store for you. This is going to be fun. <sighs> Come on, Aquarius. I can only slow them down. These demons are too strong. Yeah. But there's still one way that you can win this. There is? We barely have the time for me to say this once, so pay attention. You're strong, Lucy. Strong enough to keep three gates open. And strong enough to summon him. The Celestial Spirit King. Is that possible? Why else would I say it? This See, I didn't know that was easy. a thing. It's our only chance. <laughs> thought you needed his a key. strike from the stars can obliterate any foe, even this one. I don't have his gate key. The Celestial Spirit King has no key, Lucy. There's another way to open his gate, with a Zodiac key. The price is a hefty one, though. You can open the gate of the King only once, and only by breaking a golden key forever. <gasps> but that would mean... Losing one of my spirits. I'm gonna make you pay for every second of my time, you boys. Ah! The King's Gate will only open if the level of trust between wizard and spirit is especially strong. There has to be another way. I won't do that. I mean it. It's like you're telling me to pick a best friend and betray. It's not a betrayal if I let you. <gasps> only thing I've ever trusted you to do is act like a fool, but we do go way back. So I think it'll work. Are you saying I should do what it takes to save your friends? Yes. But you're one of them. I'm not about to sacrifice one friend to save another. It's wrong. Do you think I would suggest this if there was still another option? This is the only chance that you have. No! That's not true! You have to be strong. Please. <laughs> yes. Not ready it's for not another like sacrifice play me, here. Okay? I'll be fine. It'll be like I move. Alright, so what, it's not gonna kill her, it's just gonna mean that she can't ever summon her again, is my understanding. Your mother was an extraordinary person, the best master I've ever had. When she lost her life and my key was passed on to you, I could barely take it. You were an ignorant brat who cried all the time and took everything for granted. You didn't inherit an ounce of your mother's natural grace. But I had to tolerate you because you were Layla's daughter. <laughs> I loathed you. Despised you for such a very long time. I don't care if you hate me. You're still my first friend and I love you. There's nothing you can say that will change that. Stop trying. Quit acting like a damn child. You can lose every friend you have or you can just lose me. <laughs> what matters most in life? Keys? <laughs> Memories? Your guilty conscience? Or is it this? The strength to make sacrifices, to protect the ones you love, even when it hurts you. If that's it, then break my key right now. Natsu isn't coming. It's all on you. I love you, Aquarius. I love you so much. Yeah, I know. Now do it! Feels like my heart's on fire. I meant what I said. I hate this stupid brat. Mommy! 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 I can't stand her, but... <laughs> these emotions... It can't be a crime to protect the people you care about! Sounds wicked awesome. Same, same girl. <laughs> Jeez, I'm not ready for this. Out loud. But he's got a tail just like you. Are 
the water go? Oh my god. Let's go, King. Like, let's get it done. Nice. What's that? The has been ruptured. Oh, wow. He... Cool. Ah, what did you do? What are you? <laughs> well, I have to hold out hope, guys, that, like, you know, Aquarius is still fine. It's just that she's now going to be in the spirit world and never be able to come into our world. And maybe Lucy can see her again in the spirit world or something like that visit like that way but not cool I'm not liking these sacrifice plays guys we got the king all right He's... very curious to see how this is gonna go so all right guys we're gonna move on to the next episode let's go oh man so we got uh episode 249 now guys and Looks like we're going to have King versus King. The Celestial King against the Underworld King is kind of what was previewed or hinted at, I should say. Um, man, I'm not like... I'm so bummed about Aquarius, too. Like, I mean, she always had this, like, you know who I am. demeanor, like, you know, don't talk to me, leave me alone, very offish type of thing, but... She came through when she needed to, and you know that that one little filler episode where they kind of put on a play for Aquarius, like you really got to see like a softer side of her at the end of that episode. Seems like the old flying beast has finally been put to sleep. It has been quite a while. King of the Stars. Not oh, they know each other. enough, Mard Gear. I see you're still lugging that battered tome around with you. Have you not yet fulfilled your ambition? This holds the spirit of Yendi, the embodiment of Tartaros. Ah, and you still seek to bring life from those dead pages. You know very well what my goal is. To revive END and return to Zerif. Until it has been achieved, I will not waver. We have come far in our return to Zerif. In fact, it's looming on the horizon. Mm. <laughs> my old so I'm trying to figure out how the ground, they can get out of that like tissue pain. stuff. Did she All try to impede your journey? Yes, she did. The tears she sheds, they anger me. Are you the one who caused them to flow? Let's go. Oh. Okay, <laughs> I was gonna say, what's happening? For discussion the sunset. Long past, okay. you agree? <laughs> That's okay. Yes. That's natural. Wholeheartedly. In order to fulfill my obligation to my old friend, I will eliminate all who would do her harm. Will you? You will pay dearly for your transgressions! Gear doesn't seem phased at all by this monster giant king. Uh, so he makes, makes me think he's really powerful. Not a monster, but you get what I'm saying. Like monster size, I should king. say. You're exactly the same as you've always been. The same glaring weakness. It's quite a relief. It means that I can remain assured in my victory. Curse of Souls. Maybe he's never 
standing briars ensnare your ponderous bulk and bring about your ruin. Not long ago, you and your Eclipse spirits threatened not only your own world, but this one as well. And now you barge in here threatening to harm me and my demonic brethren. How you reek of the putrid stench of hypocrisy. You are mistaken. I admit, we did stray from our path. We let misguided ambition rule and paid dearly for it. But our friends risked everything they had and set us back on course. It is for that reason I'm here today. I owe it to them to render aid when they need it most. That is the true meaning of friendship. These rebels may set me back momentarily, but the pain they inflict is nothing compared to the suffering my friends endured to help me. You will not hold me back! Right, let's go. It's cool to see little glimpses of that arc again. I mean, it was very fillery. Again again. Um, but it, you know, it makes, seeing it now, it makes it, like, more, have more weight to it, more important moments to it. Because otherwise, I think without stuff like this, you could just kind of say, like, oh, hey, you know, nothing ever happened. <laughs> just forget about it. But this kind of makes it more relevant. Just kind of makes it stick with you a little bit. So that was cool. Get out of there, birds. I'm impressed. However, Celestial Spirit King, as I said before, you have a glaring weakness. Even your title betrays it. What do you mean? You're bound by Celestial Law, the rules that govern your interaction in this world. So although you may tower over me now, my ultimate victory is set in stone. Ah, damn it! My tail's caught under this friggin' boulder! You did this, didn't you? Stop with all the pitiful blubbering and answer me! Whenever I see someone crying like that, it makes me want to gouge out their eyes! I said enough! Can't be. Can't be that easy. What? A force field of water? holds a great deal of magic power in her hands, and that is now shared with you. Celestial Spirit King? Use it. Stand up! This was her last gift to me. Her power. Rise, and make use of what you've been given. Oh, cool. I will! My old friend. May the radiance of the stars be your guide. So she has Aquarius powers now? That's you awesome. That's super cool. She can control water and like do all this you cool stuff. For everything. So live on inside her, through her, like you forget my Man, that's awesome, let's go. You. Cool outfit too. Nothing. Done, Jackal. No way! That's impossible! It's gonna make Lucy so sorry. much more powerful now than she ever was. This is awesome. Forever. This'll get your attention! Explosion spiral! I have to save my tears. What the I don't get it! Because right now. I need to help my friends. I need to fight. Uh. Oh, stars far and wide that embody the heavens, 
I implore you, Tetra Biblos. By thy radiance, reveal thy form to me. Eternal ruler what is she babbling about? Now that the aspect is complete, I ask that you lend your power to me. Let your unrestrained rage flow. Open the raging, tumultuous gate. I don't know what she's saying, but I know that it's not going to be good. With all 88 heavenly bodies. <laughs> Shining! Gerardo Latria! Yeah, let's go. No, don't do it! Oh, goodness. Man, that was so cool. Like, this, uh... The spell that Lucy just did, like, I... I the last time I think we saw it was in the games, where she did that whole thing, and it was like a sneak attack from Raven Tail, and so nothing ever ever happened with it. But I always love it every time that she does it. It's such a cool, cool attack. What is this magic? Conjury of the celestial world. The oh, wow, so Jackal's... Survived. Jackal's done already. <laughs> All right. Nice. You're not as spry oh, as it. before. Could it be that something is ailing you? It seems my old friend has exhausted her strength. A spirit, however large and imposing they may appear, is inexorably bound to its summoner. The spirit also loses its potency. It really is a shame. But regardless, this is where you end. <laughs> I swore an oath to eliminate you. Come to me. May the starlike fantasy of the 88 illuminated bodies. Oh man, here we go. The spirit with celestial might. Galactia Blade! It's an omnidirectional attack. Strange light be. Uh, oh man, is he freeing everybody? Here we go. <laughs> Let's go. Earth. We'll strike you down. Yes, the fight I hunger for. What I need. The fight we all hunger for. The passion is electric. It makes me feel alive. So are they all coming back? All right, cool. Yeah, they are. This is awesome. Let's go, guys. Hey, the fight is on. Where'd you go? Pray, my love. Where are you? Oh, well, that sucked. Is it over now? Shadow Gear, Levy, are you here? We're here. It's a miracle that we're not dead. Yeah, right. And I'm getting crushed over here. Hang Levy. on, I'm coming. <laughs> You're not playing hero, Tubby. That's because I obviously am one. Clean out your ears. She clearly called for me. Oh crap, we both heard her say please save Gosh, you will get her. Manly! Oh, Elfman got her. Okay. Good. He beat us to it. Katsu, where are you? My head feels kind of weird. Like it's heavier or something. Hey! Are you okay? Man, am I glad to see you. I smoke too much to be running. <laughs> Does this mean we're all up and moving around again? I just know that I think we're alive. What's the matter with me or Jane? She's just exhausted. Let's go get our guild mates. It's crazy out here, but we'll find them. I wonder about Natsu and Lucy. <laughs> You've broken the Alegria curse. The cleansing light of the stars has chased away the sinister shadow you've cast. My old friend and her comrades will finish the job here. They will send you back to where you belong. Curse you. You saw my bond as a chain tying me to a weight, but this is not so. 
This bond connects our hearts and minds. It means we share in our goals. It means we will finish what the other Loving has become so much, guys. without question. Feeling it. The music's coming. We're building up to a big moment. It is far from a weakness. In fact, this bond is our greatest strength. You ignorance of love, trust, and friendship. The concepts would never enter your mind, so you neglect them at your own peril. There is one more thing I must do to help my comrades. My dear friend, I look forward to our next meeting. I know it will be under more joyful circumstances. You're running away? Ooh. No, what is this? Does that starry-eyed fool think he can stop me? I know that victory shall be mine in the end. If the humans and the king truly share hearts, I'll just have to make them cease their beating. They will share death. Wow. Oh. How is this possible? That pitiful little girl took out both Lummy and Jackal? Her magic must be more powerful than we thought. I can't stop. They need me. I gotta help them. He should have just killed her when he had the chance. But I'll do it now. There we go. This was one of the fights teased in the opening credits, so I'm excited to uh, see how Gajil does here with this guy. It would appear Markir's Alegria curse has been lifted. The fairies will fall. It is their fate. Let's go. Juvie. Juvia. I won't let you harm my friends. Cool down. We're gray. Let's get gray in here. There we go. Oh, Lucy's just realizing they're they're all coming back. Nice one. Fire. Heat it up. There we go. What is this? Fire attack. The fight's on, man. Let's go. Let's go. Wow, Lucy. I don't know how you did it. But you saved the day. You are one tough little lady. We'll work together and finish what you started. You deserve to take a break. Thank you. All right. Looks like we've got our work cut out for us. These guys are serious. All right, let's go. I'm fired up now. All right, guys. Well, that was really cool. Really cool moment. Uh, Lucy saved the day. Fantastic. Love Lucy. Um, but yeah, man, like I'm so bummed about Aquarius. First of all, I got to comment. Uh, her sacrifice play was very emotional. Um, but it really left me guys with the feeling like that she's not dead. She's not gone. She's just now in the spirit world. And so I feel like there's going to be a way that she can just live on in there and like that she'll be fine. And maybe, you know, after all this is done, they're going to hang out, party in the spirit world again and get to see Aquarius. Um, that's my thought, I guess. I don't know if, you know, if, if that's wrong, guys, let me know down in the comments. But that's what I took away from her whole speech there when she sacrificed herself. But that Lucy's not going to be able to use the key anymore to call on Aquarius. But now that she's going to be able to just kind of bring the powers forth, I guess, of Aquarius to then do herself. So she'll be able to control water herself. Uh, it was really cool, really cool. And, and like, really cool idea. So I, I never would have thought of that happening. So that was awesome. Um, and yeah, guys, so so that was the big moment, I think, out of these two episodes. And now we have everybody freed out of that, like, tissue stuff, whatever that was. Uh, the Allegria's defeated, and we're all... Looks like we're going to have our, like, our final attacks. Everyone's going to be fighting in their own little 
you know, competition against each other of Tartarus. Let's see what happens Fairy next. Fairy Tail is finally back in action and ready to Let's spring go. into battle against the Demon Gates of Tartarus. Meanwhile, Wendy and Carla learn the disturbing truth about the plan to use face, and it's not over yet. Tension is building everywhere, and as our members pick up the pieces, Urza and Minerva's rivalry has exploded into a life-or-death face-off. Next time, Tartarus chapter Urza versus Minerva. All right. Where does true strength come from? <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, so it looks like next time, guys, we're going to have Urza and Minerva finally have their big fight. Uh, I'm really excited about that because that, their last fight, guys, at the games was just insane. It was really cool, really good fight sequence. It was my favorite fight. You know, her, them and uh, Kagura, the, the three of them fighting each other was my favorite fight of the games. Uh, and I loved it. And so I'm really excited to see what happens next with their fight. I'm really excited to see more about, you know, Gray and Silver and... and you know, I like I kind of said a couple videos goes again, guys. I they ha I don't think they flat out confirmed it yet, but I really think that Silver is either going to be Gray's dad that somehow survived Deliora, or uh, that he's going to be some kind of relative of Gray and you know some family connection because they could both do ice powers. I noticed on Silver there's the little cross earrings and Gray has the cross necklace, so there's a lot of little connections there uh, that I think will probably be revealed very soon. Uh, but we're going to be back, guys, next time with the final three episodes of the that you know are kind of fit in with the opening and then we're going to uh, move on next time with the new opening new color scheme all that stuff i like to do so uh we'll be back guys soon so be on the lookout for more episode reactions of fairy tale coming soon thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today and please like and subscribe if you haven't yet please consider patreon if you're interested in supporting uh this channel and uh like i said guys we'll be back soon so thanks for watching and take care have a good day